Oh, man. Here, here, I'm calling you here. I'm not even ready for you yet. Which is, oh, first of all, I'm going to put on the ATOS hat. Oh, I need a button. Whoa. Which one is that? Oh, what would be appropriate? Oh. Oh, let's do this one. Ah. This would be good. Now, if I can remember what I put, what I'll do is I won't tell you right now. I'll wait to the end and tell you if I remember. Because, you know, sometimes we don't remember what we're doing. And that'll be all right. I'm not going to tell you what it is. At the end, you may or may not find out, depending on <laughs> if this old brain can do what it do. What else do I need? Oh, hey. Hey, put, let me shed some light on this situation. Hey. Come. Ah. Percy Lee. His flag. Well, his flag, but it's a flag of somebody else. This is my Moringa bitters. With, uh, I'm really not ready. Now I can open this thing and I don't know if I can do this. We shouldn't use our teeth, now should we? Yes, we do. Yes. I got this from Watkins. I didn't see Watkins was open today. Not that I could do anything. I really am no money, no, no money now. I'm um, put invested everything in things that might may or may not <laughs> help you to live <laughs> during this pandemic. Oh, okay. Let's see. That's what I got to take my. Take my bitters first. Like that. I got the big bottle. Hey, remember, they're not going to let me. <laughs> I can't get back. South Africa's locked down until the end of May. You know, dead talking, whatever it is. So this should last me until, I don't know, July. In fact, you know, here's my theory. Here's my theory. I have a theory. Since the, um, the virus is not... Uh, it's not heat resistant, you know what I mean? Heat does affect it, right? They just were hoping that you know, like spring is kind of getting warm out there now. That spring comes in, that summer comes early. You know, Stevie want to hotter than July, <laughs> they would be hot in July, and, you know. <sighs> Moringa biz. Um, you know, hotter than July, and that the heat will start, you know, controlling stuff. Then I gotta take my black seed after I take black seed. I'm supposed to take two a day. I think I wanna cut down. You know? I'm gonna start taking one a day because I'm taking so much other stuff. So I'm taking I'm only gonna take one a day. Oh no, brother. You know, you understand. Follow the instructions. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have free will. Do what I want. How do we how do we say how do we say the black and I'm a grown behind man, you know. You know, the whole thing, you know what I'm saying? Like that. Get back to my mango juice. I love mango juice. My mango blend organic. Like that. Well. Wow. Mmm. Don't we just love it? Okay, look. Pay the deal. Man, New York is going to go on lockdown. It's supposed to be 8 o'clock tonight. Here's the funny thing. Well, it's not funny, I guess, what it is. <laughs> See, New York is, or the, people say like self quarantining, self, the self, whatever, uh, uh, self, whatever they're doing, sheltering, uh, social distance. And e everybody, a real New York, everybody here in New York said, yeah, man, we're going lockdown. You know, nobody's saying lockdown, but there's people on the streets. <laughs> in New York. I'm sure every place. So, because if you have a prison population that's significant, well, what are you going to say? That's the language, you know what I mean? Hey. Right. They're going to lock us down. But this is interesting because this is just the stark. I'm talking about the stark reality of being black in America. I'm talking about ADOS black. We've been locked down for a long time. Like Mr. Neely Fuller will tell you. You know, it's one big prison, one big slave ship, if you will. Some people have more privileges. Some people have less. But you're still under the thumb. But now the prison population, you know, is, you know, it's getting like like bigger. But this it is talk about prison population. I think Antonio Moore um, brought this up, and that is, you know, hey, 
they're going to have to let, start letting these people out of prison because that's a talk about petri dish. So a lot, and they have this, this aging prison populations too. Amazing. So they're going to start letting some of these people out of prison. They got to go someplace, you know. They're going to go home to you. You can't even sustain yourself. You can't. I know you can't get no organic, you know, mango juice blend. So what you going to give them? Your lead filled water? Well, I don't know. But the people got to do something. The most, everybody's talking about this, so I don't want to be on it, but the most egregious thing is these lawmakers, lawmakers, these, whatever they are, are debating how much money should we get. Still, they call it stimulus. Well, you gave bankers a real big stim system. Now they're trying to, we're going to give them $800 a month stimulus? I mean, for one, for once, once off, see what happens to try to get the economy. They even, they, I think they're even talking about trying to bail out the fracking industry, which has failed. Let me put it this way. If you go for this, you meaning us, if we go for this, we deserve to keep on being fleeced. It's as simple as that. You know, sheeple are sheeple no matter what you say, you know. And it doesn't help. I'm walking the street. You know, I got brothers walking down the street. White, uh, white supremacy. This is what white supremacy do. This what, That's always this mantra. White supremacy all down, walking down the street. It's going to be like, hey, okay. <laughs> what else is new? <laughs> This is this is a plot. Hey, but this is a plot for this and that. You got preachers talking about you know the, the Lord, whatever they're doing. This is a mess. Here's the thing. You know you could have a tiny truth in something, but then with all this stuff being spun around, you can't even get to the truth anymore because you know you're wrapped up in the the fourth the fourth ring, the fourth layer of the onion, or the twenty ninth ring of the artichoke, or whatever. whatever. You're know, wrapped up in this, and then you're just ah. So let us. Um, I mean, I don't want to repeat myself or anything like that, but let me put it this way. If they're opportunistic, then why can't we be opportunistic? There's got to be something. And then, in other words, they, they spun stuff around the truth that, that obfuscates it. Did I say obfuscates it? I like them big words. I used to go to college. But you see, if they, then why can't we wrap some stuff around? You know, we can wrap truth around truth. That's how it was. Everybody has their job. Our job is not to react, you know, and the constant when, 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 you, when you get somebody on, on, on Nancy Pelosi, then all of a sudden we say, yeah, she said it. That, that's your, your, you're wallowing with them. Your thing is, says, she said what she said. Here's what we saying. They don't even have to react to that. In other words, if you keep on putting out the truth as you see it and not reacting to that, then the, the Basically, you're taking that, your energy, you're, you're taking that chunk of time. You're taking that chunk. And instead of sharing that chunk with a little bit of what, reacting, to, well, we have to have some context, brother. No, you have no context. <laughs> this, is a, this is an emergency. <laughs> this is a, a liberation emergency. Liberation ain't got no time for no context. You're fighting. You're on the battlefield now. You know, here's what happens when you're in battle. You go into, you go into the battle with plans. Once you get into the battle, whatever plans you had, if, it ain't in, if you can't remember it, <laughs> you got to <laughs> Hey, we didn't we didn't know they were gonna send a, a we didn't know they were gonna have a fleet of frogs jumping over like that. What are we gonna do? Do you know? Yeah, you know, I grew up with uh, you know, on TV when I well not, I didn't grow up on TV, but in back down in the sixties but I have they always had like like the little rascals. I always liked the little rascals. I don't care what they said. I like the little rascal. And uh, there was there was a thing where they say, well, what you gonna do now, Spanky? Right, but that's swift in. So black people say, "Because this is this this famous thing." I love to say it too. What you going to do now, buckwheat? That's the question. What we going to do now? I like I like like we've been talking about. Take care of yourself. Drink a lot of water. Blah blah blah. Where's my water? <clears throat> Drink a lot of water. Do some exercise. Get out. You know. Get out. Get some sun. Do your vitamin D from the sun. Um, I have my vitamin D over the other place. So I won't give you any more, any more, you, you know all that stuff. But here is a, here's a thing that I think you should, that you should know. In this whole lockdown thing, whatever have you, I, I call it a situation where you can, you can alter your habits. But maybe it's time that you should really think, first of all, get, you can get a lot of sleep. Get more sleep. That's just normal anyway. Just get more sleep. Sleep, if you can't sleep no more, wake up, you know, do some stuff. Go back, you know, do some little exercise, take hot baths. 
go back to sleep. Get a lot of sleep to rejuvenate your body. And as you do that, do your breathing. Ah, there you go. Breathing exercises. Um, do things that you know that you haven't done before. Start, in other words, start a new habit. You know, even if it's talking to your your loved ones, your children. You know, read read a story. Blah blah blah. There's a whole bunch of things you can do. So I just wanted to make this very short. Why? Because I, I ain't really didn't tell you enough that you didn't know already, right? So just 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 know that we're all in this together, right? And that I guess that that's the thing. I don't care what the politicians are saying. I don't care what the corporations are saying. What happens in any kind of situation? Oh, I bring up this point. What was that? There was a movie with, with one, of the, one of the guys that did, 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 uh, did, did training, training day, that did Independence Day. You know, there's a two, em, Emmerich's guy. What, they, this guy, they always give him these big budget movies. This, this, it's the one about the flooding, the, 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 the thing after tomorrow. The same guy did the Godzilla one and all this stuff. Anyway, in this movie, um, he had a black guy, and the things were being flooded. You know, the water, the water was rising. You know, climate, climate happening. And the rich guy. Okay. Sorry, that's, that's my sister again. I keep on forgetting to turn stuff off. So what happens is, um, uh, um, he, he he he's with the, the rich guy who has never been in this kind of situation before, and, the, and 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 this guy that was homeless, you know, and the guy was homeless. Said, hey, here's what you do: he picks some cardboard and put it in his put it in his shoes. It, it, that's the point. The people on the ground are much more innovative than these people are trying to give solutions who they don't live our reality. So instead of you, there's nothing you could do. You have to alter their solutions. In other words, they're going to put some bill up, and then they're going to try to go through. You know, you're going to push this bill through, which is just not going to be beneficial to us, right? So we have to, as they're spinning their thing, we have to spin it another way, more beneficial. So if they say, we're going to give them a $1,000, we say, no, we need $2,000 plus for ADUS, we get debt jubilee. Just pu push that. You say, well, who's going to do that? Obviously, a politician's not going to do it. Somebody, got, I don't know who's going to do it. That's, that, that's what we got to do. We got we to do some think tanking. I don't know. So think about this stuff, you know. That's what I'm asking. Everybody should think about their own innovation to do and then start talking in their little groups of that innovation that can happen and deal. That's all I got to say. I being me, T from the Pattersons, taking the train to the best, taking the train to Tibet, giving you a, 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 a oh, here we go, a reality, an A-G-O-S reality. And look at that. Who is that? Who is that? Come on. That's right. Honorable Elijah Muhammad, and uh, Martin Luther King together. Think about it.